Hi, this is Ikoro Fei from Spectra Audio, and I'm here to show you CV Toolkit 2.0. CV Toolkit is a software that can generate control voltages to control analog synthesizers, and the new 2.0 version is a complete rewrite and redesign. The first thing you're going to notice when you open up CV Toolkit 2.0 is the new design. All the different parts are now concentrated into a single window, which makes it a lot easier to use. The new interface is divided into three sections the 12 slots, the sidebar, and the utility rack. You can now load any of the available modules to any of the slots. You're also free to load multiple instances of the same module. This means you can now set up the slots in many different ways, depending on the situation. In order to open the slot loader, hit the M key on your keyboard. CV Toolkit ships with 15 different modules as part of the factory pack. You can further expand the functionality of CV Toolkit by purchasing more module packs. All you need to do to install these new packs is to open the download window, enter the serial code and hit download. CV Toolkit will automatically download and install the new pack for you. All the 12 slots work exactly the same way and share the same characteristics. Two inputs, one output, independent DSP control, and access to the pitch and gate buses. The pitch bus is used to control multiple notes modules. This lets you calibrate and play up to four oscillators using MIDI or any of the other modules available in CV Toolkit. The gate bus is useful for sending gates and trigger signals from modules such as the clock generator to other modules such as the AD envelope and the sequencer. This means you can use the same clock generator to trigger multiple modules. The gate bus is also used by the MIDI to CV converter to allocate different voices. In order to make CV Toolkit easier to use, we added a new help window to each of the 12 slots. Just open the slot loader, load any of the modules and click on the question mark button. The help window contains all the essential information about the module you've selected, so you don't have to refer back to the manual. The sidebar consists of the transport controls and four panels, the routing matrix, the layouts editor, the quantizer and MIDI settings, and the DSP settings. The routing matrix works exactly like it did before, except it now consists of three different layers, output, main and control. The output layer routes signals to the analog outputs and to the utility rack, while the main and control layers route signals to the two inputs of the 12 slots. Layouts lets you store and recall different layouts. Each layout remembers which module you loaded into the 12 slots, as well as the gate and pitch bus settings for each of the modules. You can use the layouts feature to store different configurations that you might want to use depending on the situation. You could, for example, store a layout for live performance and another one focused on generative patches and so on. The quantizer MIDI settings let you load and edit scales used by the quantizers in CB Toolkit as well as select what device you want to use for MIDI input, output, and MIDI clock. CV Toolkit now offers three different voicing modes. By combining multiple notes modules and the new internal buses, you can now easily create monophonic, polyphonic, or paraphonic patches. The settings pane lets you set up CV Toolkit to work with your hardware. We are proud to announce that we partnered with LittleBits and Quark to make CV Toolkit compatible with their new LittleBits USB I.O. modules. Finally, the utility rack contains some extra tools for more advanced users, including four oscilloscopes and four CV to MIDI CC converters. As you can see, we worked hard to make this new version extremely powerful and flexible, while still offering a beautiful design and a great user experience. If you'd like to know more about CV Toolkit 2.0, visit spectroaudio.com. Thanks for watching and until next time.